Good morning guys, what's up? Welcome back to another college vlog. It's currently 7.30 a.m. and I actually woke up at 5 a.m. this morning because I worked 12 hours yesterday and I had two homework assignments due at 8 a.m. this morning. I tried to work on them last night and I was way too exhausted so I just decided to wake up super early this morning and get them done and I literally finished them like just on time. But I have class at 8.30 so I'm about to pack up my backpack and get out the door. I just ate a waffle for breakfast, had a little bit of coffee but I am going to stop and grab a coffee before class because today is going to be a really long day for me and I'm just so tired so yeah. Oh my gosh, it's 49 degrees outside. I just got to Starbucks. I'm about to go grab my coffee. Literally come to the Starbucks like at least four times a week and now they know my name. It's awesome. This Starbucks is like the crowdest Starbucks of all time. So it is always so hard to get in and out of the parking lot. The parking lot's way too small for the amount of traffic that they get. And so I'm always so scared driving through this one. I'm back home from class looking a complete hot mess, but I was so cozy in this teddy coat. Very comfortable to wear to class. Anyway, Chad and I just finished writing our grocery list or about to go to the gym. I think we're doing arms today and I'm really excited. My legs are literally still sore from like three days ago. I don't even know how that's possible. Normally it only lasts like the day of and the next day, but they're still so sore. I guess just cause I'm, you know, obviously just now getting back into it. Currently opening up my Beats. I got these over the summer when I got my MacBook and I never used them. I was going to sell them because I didn't think I was going to use them, but it's a hassle trying to sell things online and dealing with like strangers and stuff. So I thought I would use them and see if I like them. I know that they're a lot more noise canceling than my AirPods. So I'm like, you know, I think I'm just gonna try them out. They've just been sitting in a corner in the other room, not even getting used. And they're like so pretty. They're like this matte black color. Oh my gosh. I really, really like them. There's a charger. Oh, charger. Here's my really quick off of the day for the gym today. I'm just wearing a sports bra that is from like Marshalls or something. I don't even know where it's from. Same with this tank. Lululemon Align leggings and my Adidas Cloud Foam sneakers. Filled up my Hydro Flask. I have my Beats headphones and I actually really like these. I was like not knowing what to think of them um, like before I opened them and then as soon as I saw what they look like and then once you put them on your ears like it just sounds really good. So I'm glad. I'm taking a break from AirPods today. I'm going to try these out. We are heading to the gym and we brought our bags and our grocery list. We're gonna go straight to the grocery store after because luckily the grocery store is right next to the gym. And I've been telling Chad for a while now that I wanna go to Trader Joe's, but it's like 40 minutes away. So we have to kind of like plan a day around doing that. And we have too many other things going on today. So maybe next week we will get to go to Trader Joe's. I just have so many things that I wanna try from Trader Joe's. Um, we have a Whole Foods near us, but the Trader Joe's is kind of far, so. Yeah, I'm excited to get some guns. I love you. I love you too. <laughs> Thanks for the camera in the face. You're welcome. Time to go get our workout on. We just finished at the gym, had a good workout. I got a chocolate protein smoothie and it has banana and peanut butter and it. it's really good. Lots of temptation over here. Not falling for it. Nope, no Doritos on my watch. Those look good. Blueberries, an avocado some tomatoes, green beans for tonight. Do they have baby cucumbers? A pepper. Get some red cabbage. This is so fresh. I wanna take a bite out of it right now. Is that weird? Sprouts, where are my sprouts? Brussels. Some Brussels sprouts. Oh, here they are. Oh, we're gonna get some of this butternut squash and we're going to basically pan sear it with like some avocado oil and a little bit of seasoning and have it with chicken and a veggie. Yeah, but then. Oh, I think, I think this one. 
some garbanzo beans because we really, really enjoyed making a chickpea dish. And then I'm also getting some marinara sauce because I'm going to make tortilla pizzas. And this is olive oil, basil, garlic sauce for a turkey pasta that I'm going to make by myself one night this week. Hurricane tortilla. Perfect. Decided to switch out my typical Starbucks veranda blend this week and I got breakfast blend, which is a medium roast. I don't know. I just wanted to switch it up. And then I also got these chips because they looked really good. The late July brand. They're multigrain tortilla chips with chia, flax, millet, quinoa, amaranth. I'm not sure what those two are, but the other ones. Healthy. Sea salt and then Chad picked out this nacho chipotle one. And what else? I feel like I showed you guys a lot of the stuff we got. Some oatmeal. And I also got some Himalayan sea salt. So I just got out of the shower and it always feels so good when you take a steaming hot shower after a good workout. I really quick wanted to show you guys the leave-in conditioner that I've been using. I've been using the same leave-in forever. So it lasts you a really long time and it's amazing. It smells good, it detangles your hair and it like conditions it. So it'll make it really soft. Um, I do not know how to say the name. It's like this we i think you say it like we but yeah it's really great i'll link it for you guys i think you can get it at sephora um i'm almost out so i'm gonna be repurchasing this for sure so i'm just gonna let my hair air dry and now i'm gonna work on my stuff for lab i have to do a post lab analysis from the week before last week's lab and then i have to do all of the post lab for my last week's lab so this is everything from that lab but i actually have to do the post lab analysis for the last lab. Yeah, I have to calculate percent recovery for everything. And then I have to redo this graph because he looked at it and said that I need to like condense it to just show the data between like 400 and 700. Reprint and put that in here and then do this and then move on to the current experiment. with the post lab analysis for last week's I didn't do all the discussion questions yet but at least that part is over with and now I'm about to move on and start watching some of the videos from my study plan but before I get into that I wanted to talk to you guys about the collaboration that I'm doing with Melissa Maribel on YouTube so if you guys are new to my channel or you're maybe a science major or a college student and you don't know who she is she's another youtuber who teaches chemistry here on YouTube her videos are great for college students and high school students she also has a bunch of products, she sells notes, and she's got a custom study plan that you guys can follow along with me this semester if you want to watch the videos and kind of keep up with the track that I'm following as I work my way through Gen Chem 1 this semester. So if you guys are interested, you can check out the study plan in the description. It's a PDF document where all of the links are clickable, so you can go right to the videos and check out the notes and everything that's included. It's a really exciting collaboration, and I'll also link the intro video in case you guys haven't seen it yet I briefly mentioned that in my last vlog but if you didn't see that vlog then you wouldn't know so yeah I'm gonna give you guys a first-hand look at the study plan that I have for this next exam so here's what the study plan looks like and it's really cool because it's completely clickable and customizable it's got all of the videos I'll need between now and my second exam as well as some other resources and it talks about the topics covered like I had mentioned you guys can click on any of these and it will open the web page so that you can watch the videos that go along with the lessons. I think this is such an amazing resource and what's really cool about it is she's giving you guys access to it as well. So be sure to check it out in the description. We're going to be doing study sessions every single week so if you guys want to follow along make sure you go subscribe to Melissa Maribel's YouTube channel and you can follow along with my study journey this semester. It'll be fun to cover the topics together and you guys can kind of see like what I'm struggling with, how I'm doing, and it should be really cool. So it's a little bit later. I just finished doing a study sesh with Melissa Maribel. I just made a healthy little snack i got these mini cucumbers from target and they're honestly so good they're just little miniature cucumbers i just chopped them up such a good healthy snack i had to put my glasses on because even though i am back wearing contact lenses again my eyes cannot seem to handle contact lenses for an entire day they just start getting really dry towards the end of the day so i don't want to like push my look so i just take them out when they start to bother me
little bit later, Chad made us dinner because I've been in the room just doing nonstop chemistry for like the last two hours. But we have oven roasted green beans. This is that butternut squash and then pan seared chicken. It's actually the next day and I was going to upload all of these files and start editing this vlog and then I thought I might as well just vlog a little bit of today and then combine everything and just make a longer vlog for you guys because a lot of people always comment on my videos saying they wish my vlogs were longer so I figured I could make this one a little bit longer for you. It is currently 9.50 a.m. on Tuesday and I already went to Starbucks this morning. I woke up super early. I spent like two hours in there just watching videos and taking notes on chapter three and chapter four for chemistry so we're basically doing periodic trends electromagnetic radiation and like working with the colors on the light spectrum and all that stuff so I got through a lot and I feel really good about it I signed up for a vinyasa gentle yoga class because my legs are still sore so I thought it would be really good for me to go and take a hot yoga class and just like stretch out um, because now my arms are getting sore too because I worked out arms yesterday. So I think it'll be really, really good for me to just take a nice yoga class today instead of doing any like weight training. And then at 12, I'm going to my professor's office hours for chem lab and I just have a billion questions for him. So I've already written those down and I have a short report that's due tonight at midnight and I pretty much have barely even started that so we have to work on that as well today um i would like to go get my nails done because these are looking pretty rough if i have time i feel like i took it for granted the concept of being able to wear sunglasses because that whole two weeks when i was only able to wear glasses i had to drive around in my car without sunglasses on and it's awful the sun just like pierces your eyes and i have such an appreciation for being able to wear sunglasses now I'm staying hydrated today. I filled this whole thing up and yesterday I drank my entire Hydro Flask and even more than just that because I had like a cup of water when I was at home but I actually drank the whole thing and I'm really proud of myself which I should be drinking more than that but it's a step in the right direction. So I finished yoga and I'm currently driving home right now. I had such a good workout like let me tell you that was like the best. If you have sore muscles, that's the one to go to. So it's vinyasa gentle and it's just a bunch of stretches and it feels really good. My whole body just feels super stretched out and I really needed that. So now I have to hurry up, go home, shower really, really fast and then head to my professor's office. I told you guys I'm meeting him at 12 and it's already 11.30 now. So. Really quick, wanted to open up my package from Lululemon. I placed this order kind of a while ago and I feel like it took a long time to get here, but maybe it was just me. Another pair of Align leggings. I'm just hooked. I honestly wear them even when I'm not working out just to wear for the day like as athleisure because it's just comfortable. So I saw that they had this new color. Um, what is it called? I don't know that. I feel like it's called like dark chrome or something, um, but it's like a really neutral. I don't even know how to describe this color. Um, I really, really like it though. So I just got the same one that I always get, which is the Align Pant in 25 inches. And I get a size four. Very, very cute. These actually are, these are different than my typical Aligns because these are like the new Lou material. So they're actually quite a bit thicker, I can already tell. I also got another sports bra. I told you guys that I was loving the energy bra. Um, and I usually only wear black sports bras unless it's like a set and they did not have a matching one for this like dark chrome color. So I just ended up getting this one, the Invigorate bra. So it's just like a typical black sports bra and then the back is like mesh. I really like the looks of it. It looked really cute on the model and it looks really supportive. So I think this would be a great one for cardio. I'll let you guys know what I think about these and I'll link these for you as well. I hurried up and showered and I changed into this new Lululemon sports bra as well as the leggings and I really like them. The material's definitely like double layers thick. Um, so if you live somewhere where that's a factor and you need to stay warm, they would be awesome. For me, it could get a little frustrating during the summer, but I really like the thickness because it just smooths everything out even more than like the typical Align leggings. So I really like them and I'm wearing 
using them today, so I can really find out. I literally just grabbed a pack of carrots to eat because it's the only quick thing I had, and I'm starving. I'm just gonna eat carrots. I'm just glad I had time to take a shower, because I do not want to go see my professor all sweaty. I'm at school, walking to my professor's office. My heavy backpack, I don't even know why I brought this thing. I always bring it everywhere because I'm so afraid I'm gonna need something, even though I'm literally just going in there to ask him a question. I really only need it in my Mac, but this is what I do. So I went to my professor's office hours and I got my questions answered, thank God. And now I'm at Target. I'm about to go in and look for one of those five-star binders that has like the, like, I feel like they're just like the plastic clip-in, um, like binder punches. I don't even know if I'm making sense, but the one with the paper and it's like got a flexible thing because I have an entire like chemistry formula sheet that Melissa Maribel gave me and I want to put them in clear protective sleeves so that way I have a safe place to keep them that also has notebook paper in case I need to write anything down. So this is what I was attempting to describe to you guys but now that I'm looking at it I don't really think this is what I want. I thought maybe this would work but I don't really like it so I'm gonna look for something else. I grabbed some protein bars while I was in Target because I'm actually gonna go get my nails done now because I think if I don't go like the second once I get home I'm not gonna want to go back out so I'm just gonna go ahead and go get them done now I'm gonna have a protein bar to hold me over and then when I get home I'll eat lunch or maybe I'll get a bowl I don't know update for you guys I got my nails done and I am literally in love with them I decided to go back to short nails because my nails just needed a break from the long nails and also I was having a difficult time with my calculator calculations in chemistry so I was like I should really go back to short nails so that I don't keep clicking the wrong button anyway I went with this really pretty nude color it's Kiara Sky at number 536 I finally remembered to get the number for you guys because you always ask me like what the color is and I'm like um it's a nude pink color and like I never know so it's Kiara Sky 536 very pretty pretty nude color. It's not even really pink. It's just like straight up nude. I love it. Now I'm going into Sweetberry to get a green salad because I need some lunch. So I just got home and I'll show you guys the salad I got from Sweetberry. So this is the Greek goddess salad and it has spinach, kale, olives, tomatoes, onions, feta cheese, and then like a balsamic vinaigrette. It looks amazing and it's super healthy. So definitely like a super food salad. I can't wait to eat this and then I'm gonna get some schoolwork done. I am gonna go ahead and end this vlog. I'm sure by now it's super long, although I haven't edited it yet. Um, but thank you guys so much for watching today's video. If you're not already subscribed, be sure to click that subscribe button and I'll see you in my next video.